Alright guys, in this video we're going to download ZAMP to our Mac, and I apologize if you guys are on Windows because I don't have a PC, but you can still follow along and I'll try to explain my best on how to download ZAMP for a PC. So, again, by downloading ZAMP we are going to have Apache, which is our server, MySQL, which is going to be our database, and we're also going to download the newest version of PHP, which is 5.3.1, but it's, Ju it's July 6, 2002, so if you're watching this from a year from now, I can almost guarantee it's not going to be version 5.3.1. It'll probably be something like version 7.4. Mark my words. One year from now, they're going to be on PHP. They're going to have so many more PHP functions that they're going to be on a new version 7.4. But don't disregard what I just said. Right now, we're downloading PHP 5.3.1. So let's go ahead and download XAMPP. So I'm going to open up a new tab. Just go to Google. You could either I'm in Chrome, so I could type it here or here. I'll just go ahead and type it up here so I can utilize Chrome, ZAMP, two Ps. And this is the one that we want. We want Apache Friends hyphen ZAMP. And again, it's got all the downloads for Windows, Mac, OS X, and Linux. So let's go ahead and click on it. And we're going to scroll down a little bit. And again, we are on Mac OS X. So we're going to be downloading this um, file to our applications folder. And if you're on Windows, you're going to download this to your program. So you're going to take your ZAMP folder and you're going to put it in your program. So give me a question or uh, sh shoot me a comment or question. I'll try to get back to you guys um, in an email or something. ZAMP for Mac OS X. That's what I want. Click on this. Scroll down a little bit. And this is the link we're looking for. Mac OS X 1.7.3. It's 86 megabytes. So make sure you have like a little bit of storage in your hard drive right now because that's kind of a lot. And go ahead and click on this. It's going to take me to another page with a million more advertisements. That's why it does it. It could just take me to the download, but it's going to show me all these guys paying the big bucks to get their uh, business showcased right here. Okay, so right down here, I'm in Chrome. If you're in Safari or uh, what's the other one, Firefox, your downloads icon is going to show up here on the top right. But I'm going to go ahead and discard it because I already have it downloaded. But for you guys, you guys are going to click keep. So I'm going to discard it. And when it's done, click on it. This is this is what I just downloaded. And it's going to open up. It's going to probably take like another couple seconds to load. And you're going to get to this page and grab your ZAMP and drag it into your applications folder. But I already have it there, so I'm not going to do it. But you guys don't have it, so you guys are definitely going to need to do it. So I'm going to go to my applications right here. Here's my applications. And I'm going to scroll down to my ZAMP folder. And I'm going to grab my ZAMP control because I'm on it so much and uh, for the remainder of this video you guys are going to be on it too just pull it to your dock or if you're on a PC you can pull it to your desktop because I like to keep it right here on hand and uh, okay if you guys made it this far you have successfully downloaded ZAMP to a Mac and hopefully to a PC, PC as well so thanks for watching guys and good luck